Question 10b. In a resonance tube experiment using a tuning fork of frequency 256 Hz, the first position of resonance was 35 cm, the next position was 100 cm. Calculate the velocity of sound in air from the experiment. Uh, we just have to solve this a simple question and uh, solution. Let's do that as fast as we can. We are given, it's always good to extract this information. We are given, we are given that the frequency from the equation is this. This is the frequency which is equal to 256x. That is one part. We are given that. We are also given that the first position of resonance, let's call that L1, is equals to 35 cm. And this 35 cm converted to the SI unit, which divided this by 100, that is converting cm to meter, that will be 0 0.35 meter. Just divide this by 100, you have this. Again, L2, the second, the next position of resonance, 100 cm, 100 cm, 35 cm. So 100 cm, 100 cm. Again, divide this by 100, then you have one meter. You have one meter. So this is what we are given according to the equation. Now we are asked to calculate velocity. We know that the velocity of sound of this type of experiment velocity of sound of this kind of experiment v is equals to is given by a simple formula 2f into l2 minus l1 that is how this is actually derived but for the sake of this question we're just going to use this to solve now this is equals to we have our two times our frequency which is 256 into our L2 is 1 meter, our L1 is 0 0.35. So we have that. So let's go ahead with this. If you multiply, or uh, okay, let's just clear this. This is 2 times 2, 5, 6. Let's clear up this bracket. That will be times 1 minus 0 0.35. That will give us 0 0.6565. So when you multiply all that, uh, 2 times 256 times 0 0.65 you are left with 332.8 since its velocity the unit of velocity is meter per second so that is the answer to this question okay see you again in the next part of this video and don't forget to subscribe and uh, follow us ask a question where you're confused and we'll be sure to answer your question mm -hmm.